Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Thank you very much for clicking on it. I really appreciate it. Today we have some more Billy content. So uh, towards the end of last week, I did a whole uh, pre-debut Billy marathon, basically, of a bunch of their dance covers um, and the like first couple of teaser preview type of things um, gearing up for the debut, which is happening in just a couple of days. It is on Wednesday. Um, so I am going to be checking out more teasers. <laughs> so we have chapter two of, um, well, this is Billy chapter two. Um, we did chapter one in the marathon that I did last week. Um, so we're going to do chapter two. This actually dropped the day I posted that marathon, which is so typical very on brand for me <laughs> um but it's fine we're gonna check that out now we've also got the mv teaser for ring ring which i am assuming is the um uh the debut track and then we also have what i think is a highlight medley uh for the mini album uh the village <laughs> the village of perception which i think is an amazing title like in english it's very strange but if you actually think about it in korean uh, v and B have very, very similar, if not exactly the same kind of sound. Um, so it's, it's, it makes me smile every time I see it and I'm like, mm, that's clever, I like it. Anyway, <laughs> we're also going to check out that. So these are basically teasers that have dropped over the last few days. I don't know if there's going to be anything more that drops today or tomorrow. There probably is, like I said, that would be very on brand. Um, but I am just going to check out these and then I will be here for the debut itself on Wednesday. So that is the plan. Let's get into it. Now, I probably should have rewatched chapter one uh, of this before starting this video, but I didn't. Um, in terms of like what was said during it, because I know there was like voiceover, I can't remember like the details of that. What I do remember is they were in pairs and... Um, they were all in like a like a boarding school kind of thing and there was a creepy nun i remember the very creepy nun <laughs> the very creepy nun so um i remember that so there was some spookiness some creepiness some weirdness um and yeah that's kind of all i really remember but let's just go through this chapter two let's do it <laughs> the bell rang in eleven time. Oh Boy yeah, it was the kids. Away. Billy Love. Run and hide, okay. Darling, you know Billy, right? I mean... Now I've got to remember the, the names. Life. I know that's Sukhyun. Haruna? Billy Maria. There's no captions, by the way. That sounds incredible. That's so right. I remembered all their names. I'm so proud of myself. So yeah, this is where we saw them in chapter one. Billy 
어디에서도 빌리를 찾을 수 없었어. 그렇게 빌리의 집의 다락방에서 누군가가 빌리를 데려가는 동안 Such like beautiful cinematography. <웃음> 못했어. 아무도. Like I said, there's no captions, so I can't really keep I track of. Ran away from home. Isn't that crazy? Um, so yeah, I can't follow what's being said, but the visuals are stunning. Mr. Love said Billy waited her friends to come home. 친구들이 자기를 protect 해줄 거라면? 지켜? 뭘? Well, I don't know. Anyway, Billy waited for her friends to come home. But no one came. No reading at the table, darling, please. Suyan, Haruna, did you plan to go to Billy's house? Suyan? No. Haruna? I am so fascinated. Billy and to the world pitiful spending each day in sadness despair and self-criticism they are waiting for Billy So creepy. Look, these are the stairs. If you go up the stairs, there's an attic. Girls are waiting for you there. Done. Never mind. Are you kidding me? Making something that doesn't exist exist? We call it desperate. Are you desperate now? Then close your eyes. Wake up your senses and open your mind. Can you see it? Can you see it? Don't you need a ticket? Yes, my friend, you did well. Go up the stairs and look at the world of the Eleven. I'm not gonna pretend that I have any idea what's going on. I am also not gonna pretend that I have the brain cells to figure it out because I do not. It would probably help if I had captions on the Korean parts, but um, what I can say is I am so fascinated and so intrigued and very excited to try and figure it out. That's gonna have to be something that I do in my own time because I am not just gonna sit here and just go, 
for like two hours while I try to figure it out. <laughs> um, but if you guys have any uh, tips on how, like, you know, on and any like details that might help me figure it out, please do. Because I really want to know, like, just figure out exactly what is going on and what the what the deal is here. Because I am so confused, but it looks amazing. It sounds amazing. Um, and like I said, I am fascinated. Fascinated fascinated so yeah i'm just very excited to see what the hell is going on so yeah we're gonna get into the mv teaser now um yeah i'm i'm wondering if that part of the song that or a song that we heard like midway through that is this i guess we'll see three two one go Oh, I'm so excited. What a tease. What a tease. That was an amazing tease. <laughs> I was literally just like, no, I need more. I need more. I'm going to go through it one more time. I cannot wait to see this choreo. I have rewatched so many of their dance covers. Like I've rewatched um which ones have I rewatched the most? I've rewatched the 16 shots one, I've rewatched the slumber party one, I've rewatched the um my brain just gave up, but there's a couple of others that I've rewatched a lot as well. I could just watch them dance all day. I'm so excited to see the choreo for this. So cute. Like 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 we're not ready for the dance line that this group is. Like, we're just not ready at all. Like, I would argue that four of these members could easily qualify for a main dancer position. I don't know what their official positions are going to end up being, if they're going to have official dance positions. I know that I think the, like, main dance line is considered to be Sua, Tiki, and Shiyun. Um, I would argue Suhyun is good enough to be considered in that, whether she will be officially or not, I don't know. But, like, it's one thing to have, like, a really strong dance line in a group. It's a whole other thing to have two-thirds of the group be main dance material, like, genuine main dance material. Like, it's kind of wild. <laughs> this is, I think, the first time I've come across a group. And this is saying something. This is the first time that I've come across a group since Itzy that I felt that their main dance line could rival Taeon for like the number one main dancer in a fourth gen group. It's the first time <laughs> since Itzy, who debuted in 2019. Like it's been two and a half years basically, um, since 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 their debut. Um so that's kind of wild. And that's not to say that we haven't had absolutely incredible dancers because we have. There are like the fourth gen in general is full of phenomenal dancers. There's a difference between being an amazing dancer and competing with people like Taeyong, Taeyong and Yedzi. Um <laughs> This group. Ooh. <laughs> ooh. Goddamn. Anyway, sorry. I got I got distracted and on my shit, but So cute. God, I just I want more so badly. I want more so badly. It sounds so good. God damn it. Okay, right. We'll just go on to the highlight medley. <sighs> I have pre-ordered this, by the way. Because <laughs> of course I did. I literally watched that marathon and I was like, okay, I immediately need to go and buy this. Rap making. Okay, cool. So they wrote their own rap. Love that. Ooh, that 
Oh, that sounds fun. Vibe switch. <laughs> oh, right, yeah, we've heard this. Okay. Beautiful song. I listened to it a couple of times after I did that marathon watch. It's just beautiful. Mm. Ooh, that guitar. Okay, I think this one's probably going to be my favourite. <laughs> I'm predicting it now. sampling something in the background which which song is it i think it is i think it's dance of the sugar plum fairy that they're sampling in the background there i think it is hang on let me go let me listen to that bit again I think it is way in the background there. I think it is. I think Dance of the Sugar Moon Fairy is back there. That's really cool. Hang on. Let me. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. When like pop music or anything like, like, um, uh, draws from classical like uses like samples it uses an influence like it like it just i just think it's great that is awesome oh so oh, the vocals of that sounds amazing god damn the versatility in this Yeah, that's Billy. Oh, okay. This is gonna be fun. I'm not gonna go through that again because I don't actually have time. I have to do something in about ten minutes. But um, that all sounds incredible. The versatility, the range. We love to see it. Um, I actually really like that in a debut album um, because it's like it gives them a lot of different avenues and like roads to go down in the future. Um, it shows that they can cover like a diverse range of concepts. Like I just think it's great, and that all sounds incredible. Especially excited for. Um, 11th day and what was that everybody got a secret yeah those two i'm especially excited for those two as well as the title track but it all sounds great i will be checking out the mv react uh, doing the mv reaction over here on youtube when it drops i will also be checking out the album over on patreon so feel free to come through and check that out with me if you want to but no worries if not um i will see you on wednesday for the mv reaction nonetheless and i'm gonna end this one here thank you very much for watching i will catch you in the next one Bye bye